everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm coming to you guys today to talk about a product that I've already talked about and I'm going to explain to you why. <laughs> So I'm coming to you guys today to talk to you about a lavalier microphone. I talked about this lavalier microphone in a previous video and I thought I was using the microphone in that video. As it turns out, I was only using the camera's audio. I plugged this in, I didn't get any sound and so I plugged it into a different location thinking, okay, I must have plugged it into the wrong spot and I got sound, so I thought it was working, and all along it was actually the camera's audio that was doing the recording. The reason it didn't work when I first plugged it in was I needed to use the adapter that comes with this, and I didn't realize that until later. So it's just a lot of things going on when I received this product that caused me to not actually use it when I thought I was using it. So here we go. Right now I'm currently recording with a different microphone and I'm going to make the switch in just a moment but I just wanna show you guys this product. It comes in this box and it also comes with, it says with the four pin to three pin adapter included, the mic will work on PC, laptop, desktop, most recorders, okay? It comes with this small adapter here, which I wasn't using and I didn't realize was creating my issue. <laughs> so it comes in a little pouch like this. It has some information here that tells you a how-to guide that tells you what you've received and how to use it. It also comes with three extra wind muffs and then there's one here already. And this is what it looks like with the adapter on. It has a little piece of Velcro that keeps it together. And this is what it looks like. And this is the adapter. This fit on my camera, so I thought I was in business, you know, I thought it was working, but I needed the adapter. And it does plug into your camera and then there's a little part here that clips to your clothing or whatever you want to clip it onto. So I'm going to plug this in really quickly and switch from my Rode GoPro on the go or something. It's a Rode microphone and I'll switch from my Rode microphone to this very affordable lapel mic or lavalier microphone and let's see the difference, okay? So here we go. All right guys, so here's my microphone. I'm going to try to be extremely gentle because I don't want it to make a lot of noise as, to make a lot of noise as I clip it. And I'm going to just clip it onto something that sits in front of me. Okay, let me do it this way. This is like a, a little ring holder <laughs> that I thought would be perfect because it's out of the way, it's very small. Look at her, and she's sexy. And I'm going to sit it here in front of me. So here it is, testing. One, two, testing. I'm sure I'm pretty loud. Testing, one, two. Okay. So now it is sitting in front of me. And here we go. All right. This is the Pop Voice PV610 Lavalier Microphone. I think it was like really, really inexpensive, like $10 maybe, something like that. I'll be sure to link it down in the description box. If you're a beginning YouTuber and you're looking for some audio that's a little bit better than your camera's audio, then this might be something you'll want to try out. This does work with your cell phone. I hear of people who record their audio using their cell phone. You can plug this microphone into your cell phone. It may be better than just using your open microphone on your phone. That's an option. So yes, this does plug in. It does have an adapter. It's really affordable. Um, the only thing that is a drawback or a negative to having a microphone set up that is like this is you can only be so many feet away from your camera. So this 
comes with a cord. And this particular one is 6.5 feet. In this picture, there's other products that have longer cords. Now for my type of work, the type of videos that I film, I'm sitting about three feet maybe, or two or three feet away from my camera. So uh, this works fine for me. I don't need to be across the room. But if you're using the type of lens where you need to be farther away or your videos are not this type of video, then this might not work for you. You may want something else that can go the distance, okay? I didn't have to come back and film this video again, but they sent me this product to review and I thought I reviewed it. And when I learned that I hadn't, I really thought that it was best practice for me to go back and record this again so that I was doing the company justice as well as my audience. I want you guys to actually hear what this microphone sounds like because basically what you were hearing before was my camera's audio, okay? So now this is the Pop Voice microphone. This is what it sounds like. I haven't adjusted the audio settings in my camera and sometimes you hear Hear people say to turn your audio settings all the way down but I did that and I didn't get the best results with my other microphone so I haven't adjusted the audio settings of my camera I am going to make adjustments to the sound quality in post like when I am editing the video it says if you have questions contact us at www.popvoice-us.com so they do have a website I think that this was sent to me from the company on Amazon so they must have an Amazon site as well as a website I'll link the product that I received in the description box so that you guys can check it out if you're interested so I hope that you all have enjoyed today's video. Remember to thumbs up the video if you did. Also leave any comments or questions for me. I will respond. And if you've not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button before you leave. So I'll be seeing you guys again very soon in my next video. So until the next time we meet again, this is Savvy signing out.